Although, Samsung hasn't officially unveiled the Galaxy S23 yet. Almost all its features and even the design have leaked over the past couple of months. Yesterday, the complete specifications list of the Galaxy S23 series was leaked through promotional images. However, it had one mistake. The images mentioned LPDDR5 RAM, which was also used in the Galaxy S21 series and the Galaxy S22 series. However, that isn't true. Tipster Ice Universe has confirmed that the Galaxy S23, Galaxy S23 Plus, and Galaxy S23 Ultra Use LPDDR5 XRAM and USS 4.0 storage. The combination of a new generation chipset, Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 for Galaxy, new RAM, LPDDR5X, and new storage, USS 4.0, on the Galaxy S23 series will offer a huge boost in performance. You can notice that in various areas, including phone boot up speeds, app and game launching, multitasking, and gaming. Yesterday, it was reported that Samsung might launch the Galaxy S23 series at higher prices than the Galaxy S22 series in some markets. However, a newly leaked document from a network carrier in the US has revealed that Samsung will stick to the $800 starting price with the Galaxy S23 series. A Galaxy S23 series promotional leaflet from Verizon was posted on Reddit, spotted by 9 to 5 Google. A few hours ago, it reveals all the information about the Galaxy S23 series, including their features, pricing, announcement date, pre-order date, and launch date. The Galaxy S23 starts at $799.99, while the Galaxy S23 Plus will have a starting full retail price of $999.99. The Galaxy S23 Ultra will be sold with a price tag of $1,199.99. Plus, Samsung could offer free storage upgrades for all pre-orders. So, if you pay for the 128GB version of the phone, you will get the 256GB variant at no extra cost. Are you excited about the Galaxy S23? You can pre-reserve it now and get up to $100 in-store credit. Link in description. What do you think about today's leak? Comment down below. For more videos, hit the subscribe button. See you tomorrow. Peace out.